Sounds like the storm's getting real bad. Whoa, what just happened? Ah! Jessica, watch out! OMG! Britt, you saved me. How did you see that car? It came out of nowhere. See you in class, girly. That was so weird. I'm a psychic. That was so crazy, right? I literally saw that car accident before it even happened. But thank goodness I was there to warn Jessica in time. There's no way I have psychic abilities, right? All I know is I'm just so glad I finally made it to school. Oh my gosh, that's the ugliest shirt I've ever seen. Does she even own a hairbrush? Um, I'm sorry, excuse me? What? I didn't say anything. Freak. Wait, what did you just call me? I'm not a freak. Oh my gosh, did she hear that? Can she read my mind? You know what? Never mind. I, I gotta go. This can't be happening. I can read people's minds too. But whatever I do, I can't let anyone at school know that I'm a psychic. Because this could go totally wrong. Just like my hair. Oh my goodness. What is happening? Oh, okay. Good as new. Wait a second. There's my best friend, Sophie. Hey, Soph, Soph. Hey, Britt, how's it going? Girl, you won't believe what just happened to me. What is it? Wait, hold on a second, Sophie. Why are you daydreaming about Josh, the star quarterback? I'm trying to tell you something. I wasn't thinking about Josh. Britt got me. Wait, wait, wait. Oh my gosh, no, 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 no. Sophie, you are crushing so hard on him. I, I, I can't help it. He's just so... I want to go out with him so badly. Wait, girl, you want to go out with him? Okay, Bestie, are you reading my mind or something? That was what I was trying to tell you before you started daydreaming about Josh. Girl, you can read minds. That's so cool and terrifying. Hold on, hold on. What am I thinking of now? Wait, better not be lying because this will come in handy when I want to take over the world one day. So, um, absolutely not. We are never going to take over the world. But, girly, there's more than just mind reading. I can see the future. This is so exciting! Just remember that no one, and I mean no one, can find out about this, okay? My best is a psychic! Oh! But yeah, don't worry, girly. Your secret's safe with me. Now come on, time for class. All right, class, settle down, settle down. Time to begin our lesson. Brittany, tell me what the Pythagorean theorem is. This girl's so stupid, she won't even know it's a squared plus b squared equals c squared. Easy, it's a squared plus b squared equals c squared. Yes, that's correct. Okay, Sophie, what's an isosceles triangle? Oh, Josh is so cute. I hope the back of my head looks good because he sits right behind me. If this girl doesn't tell me that it's a triangle with two equal sides of length, then she's going to detention. Oh, it's a triangle with two equal sides. Oh, 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 yes, it's a triangle with two equal sides. Yes, I'm very smart. I pay attention. All right, pop questions are over. Time to move on to a different chapter of our book. I got my eyes on you, Simpson. Thanks for bailing me out, bestie. You know me, I was just... Daydreaming about Josh? Yeah, I know. I heard every second of that, Sophie. Oh, pineapples. Hey. Want to tell me what Josh is thinking? Yeah, sure. I I can try. Focus here. B -b 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 -hung hungry. One thousand chicken nuggets. No, no. uh, so I, I can't really make out what he's saying. Yes, class is over. Excuse me. Oh my gosh, he's so dreamy. Oh, you know what, Soph? Let me try again. Hey, hey, Josh, wait up. Go, Britt, you're crazy. Oh, hey, Britt. What's up? Britt, I told you. Hey, Josh. <laughs> uh, who are you? <laughs> You're so funny. This is my best friend, Sophie. Uh, she sits right in front of you in our math class. Sophie, cool. Oh, actually, we better get going to lunch. Catch you later, Josh. Bye. What? Uh, it was nice meeting you, Sophie. Dude, another day out there serving us these cardboard tasting burgers. I know. What will it take to get a normal tasting lunch around here? You know what? Let's trash these burgers. Yeah, good idea. I feel bad wasting food, but these are really terrible. So what was it that you were trying to tell me? Okay, okay, so what if I read Josh's mind to see exactly what he thought about you? Mm, I don't know, Bestie. Isn't that kind of invasive? It's like reading someone's diary or reading someone's text when they leave their phone on the table. I'm not saying that I've done that, but... Mm, yeah, you're right, Soph, but come on. Wouldn't it be interesting to know? But what if what you find out only hurts my feelings? 
Oh my gosh, bestie, I would never let that happen. And besides, he already thinks you're cool. Or at least that's what I thought I could read earlier. You know what? Yes, you're right. I am cool. And I know I can trust you, Britt. Now let me go find him and see what's up. All right. Sophie is right. I mean, this is kind of like reading someone's diary, but it's okay. It's okay. It's only going to help my bestie. Oh, Hey, Josh. Well, hey, Britt. Sup? So, hey, you know my best friend Sophie, right? Uh, yeah. She's pretty. Okay, cool. I'll catch you later, Josh. <laughs> what the heck just happened? Is Brittany just as weird as Sophie? Okay, okay. Say that one more time. Well, like I said, it wasn't 100% clear because for whatever reason, his thoughts come through my head like super staticky. But he said you're pretty. <laughs> Well, it's a mile, look <laughs> Oh, my pineapples. This literally is a dream come true. I know you're excited, Sophie, but shh. No one can know about this. I don't want the whole school hearing you freak out and knowing I can read minds. Oh, right, right. Oh, sorry. Wait, wait. Sophie, 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 look, look, look. There he is now. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my hands are sweating. Hey. Hey, Josh, over here. What is going on? This is so weird. It feels like everywhere I turn, I keep bumping into Britain, this girl, Sophie. Oh, <laughs> you're welcome. What did you just say? Oh, never mind. Don't worry about it. Wait a second. We won the game. I can't believe we won 37 to 7. Hey, so Josh, I have a bet for you. <laughs> okay, what is it? I'm sure I'll win. I always win. So hear me out. If I can predict the score between our team versus Westbrook tonight, you have to go on a date with my bestie. Oh, uh, yeah, sure. I'm down. I mean, um, only if you want to. <laughs> yeah, of course. I never back out of a bet. Now, what do you think the score will be? 37 to 7. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. I mean, Westbrook is literally the number one team in the country. So sorry, Soph. Looks like your best friend lost you a date with me. I don't know, Josh. I wouldn't be so sure. You're on. Catch you girls later. What? What? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Girlie, relax. I got a vision about the score, so there's no way I'm wrong. So you, my best friend, will be going on a date with your biggest crush. Oh my gosh, I should have known you were using the psychic abilities you have. <laughs> this is awesome. This is so awesome. Sophie's going on a date. Sophie's going on a date. Ooh. Now come on, bestie. I think we should do a little shopping before your date. What do you think? I'm so excited I can literally pass out. Well, how about, uh, yeah, we don't do that. <laughs> okay, fine. I just can't believe it. Sophie and Josh together forever. Ooh, 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 I'm in love. Okay, bestie, where should we go? Oh, oh, oh right, right, right. Can we please go into Beachside. Hold on. Um, on second thought, bestie, I, I don't think so. Oh, man, why not? That's where I got my custom-made hazmat suit. It's made of 100% rubber. All the other stores have them, but, like, they make couple-in-one ones here. Oh, my gosh. Bestie, I love you, but I don't think you'll be wearing a hazmat suit on your date tonight. Maybe you save that for, like, the second or third date. Oh, man. Well, I guess you're right. Trust me, girl, you will thank me later. Now, come on, how about we go into this store? It's super cute, too. This top is amazing. Oh, my gosh. Sophie, you got to try it on. I don't know, Britt. That doesn't really seem like my style. Come on, come on, come on. Please try it on. All right, fine. I'm trusting you. Yes. Let the fashion show begin. Uh, I don't know, Britt. It seem like my style. I mean, it's cute, and you always will look fabulous, but I see what you're saying. Um, maybe try on something else? Okay. All right, bestie. I mean, like I said, this hazmat suit's all right, but it's nothing like the ones next door. And it's triple the price. Uh, yeah. Nope. Next. Well, howdy, little lady. <laughs> Sophie, <laughs> this is everything. Okay, if you were going to a rodeo, then yes, a thousand percent yes. Yeah, Brett, I 
still don't really know how I feel about this. But I got one more to try on. All right, self. Make it a good one. Brett, I think this is the one. I just feel confident being myself. And not gonna lie, this is like my signature look. Then it's perfect, bestie. You ready to go? <gasps> oh, my pineapples! OMG, girlies, be careful! We've been robbed! <laughs> so is that why? Yep, yep, 100%. That's why we didn't go in that store. Uh, Brett, I don't know. What if your vision was wrong? What if our team doesn't beat Westbrook? Oh, relax, girly. When have my psychic abilities ever let us down? Oh, you're right. You're right. You're right. <gasps> Hold on. I got a text. It's from an unknown number. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Sophie, Sophie, Sophie. You got to tell me. What does it say? Dinner at 7. Josh? before my date? Why? Well, Bestie, I really want this date to go perfectly. I want to know every single thing he thinks about me so I don't say or do anything wrong. Don't have to worry about it, Sophie. Just be yourself. You're amazing. I don't know. Uh, I don't know if you know this about me, Britt, but I'm a lot to handle! Please. Pretty, 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 please. I guess so. Fine. I'll go do some investigating. But, I mean, I'm pretty sure he likes you. But I'll text you what he says. Oh my gosh. Perfect. Perfect. Ah, I'm going to go get ready. I'm going to head to Josh's house. Here we go. Hey, Brid. What a surprise. Are those flowers for me? Oh my gosh. No, Josh. These are for you to give to Sophie. Here. Oh, I like Sophie. Oh, why is it so staticky with you? Brit, what are you talking about? Uh, nothing. So, hey, are you excited? Yeah, I guess. I wish you, you, Sophie. Well, hey, you don't want to be late for your first date. Oh, yeah. Guess you're right. Later. Awesome. I should probably text Sophie and let her know that Josh likes her. Oh, I can't believe it. This is so awesome. And she's going to be so happy. It looks like she's going to put her phone on Do Not Disturb and she'll text me after. Ah, I'm so excited. I feel like a proud mom right now. My little bestie Sophie is going on her first date and she's going to have the best time. And they're they're going to get married and hopefully I can be in the wedding. And, oh, this is so good. I, excuse me. Can, can I help you? Oh, I'm sorry. I was just going. Oh, are you the weird girl my son is going on a date with? Excuse me? Yes, the girl that wears hazmat suits to school every Friday the 13th as protection from evil spirits. <laughs> Boy, you're such a freak. Are you talking about Sophie? I'm confused. She's pretty weird. Sophie's not as cool as Brit. I don't like Sophie. I wish it was you, not Sophie. Oh, no, 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 no. I totally messed up. I gotta get out of here and go talk to Sophie. Jeez Louise, looks like that girl just saw a ghost or something. My son was right. Good riddance. Come on, Sorry, Sophie. Answer your phone. Answer your phone. So, uh, you like football, huh? Uh, yep. I'm, uh, I'm the quarterback. Right. Right. So, what's your thought on pineapple on pizza? Oh, it's trash. Yeah. Agreed. So, uh, it's coming around often? So, like, how long have you known Brittany? Oh, we've known each other forever, really. Do you have a boyfriend? Yep, sure does. What's her favorite color? I I'm sorry, what's with all the Brittany questions? Well, she's super hot and I have, like, a huge crush on her. Hold the phone. Do you like Brittany? Uh, yeah. Figured if I did her this favor, she'd go out with me. Well, sir, I hope you have a time. Sophie, Sophie, Sophie! You! You set me up, Brit! You embarrassed me! No, no, no! It's not like that! Sophie, trust me! No! Take your dumb psychic abilities and get away from me! Sophie? Leave me alone! Hey, no, Sophie! Hello, Brittany! I'm not talking to you! Oh, man. Those headphones she wears. So cute. 
gosh, guys, I don't know what to do. This literally could not get any worse. My best friend has never been this mad at me. I hope I didn't lose my best friend over my psychic abilities. What are you moping around about? Oh, hey, Brenda. Sophie's mad at me. Ooh, my sister has drama. Love, 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 love. Tell me more. I don't know. It's kind of hard to explain. Okay, good, because I've lost interest now. Um, Do you have $50? Yeah, why? I'm trying to buy the new Ariana Grande perfume, and I don't want to spend my own money. So give me yours. Hey! Later, loser. Thanks for the money. Oh, man, what the heck? First I lost my best friend. Now I'm out $50? This day couldn't get any worse. Oh, my gosh. Maybe it's Sophie. Coming. Ugh. You. Here, got these for you. Figured you'd like them. Well, yeah, I'm the one that picked them out. I'm supposed to give these to Sophie. Gosh, pretty so pretty. Thanks for coming by. I don't mean to be rude, but I'm too busy. I need to figure out how to fix things with my best friend. Later. Hey, Brett, who was at the door? It was Josh the quarterback. Josh the quarterback? <gasps> Hi, <laughs> what are you doing here? Uh, trying to ask Britta on a date. Ew, why would you want to go out on a date with her? I'm much prettier. Have I introduced myself? I'm Brenda, Brittany's sister. Uh, okay, well, do you want to go out? Yes! You're taking me to the mall. Let's go. Where is Sophie? I really need to apologize to her. I can't lose my best friend forever. You know, I really should have pursued my dream of becoming a professional hand model instead of teaching. Oh, I can't take it anymore. I did not need to know that about Miss Kalachi. I totally love crop dusting the bus at the end of the day. Here I come! Bartsville! What? Ew, 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 I did not need to hear that. I thought having psychic powers would be awesome, but the things you hear, oh my gosh. Wait, hey, hey, Sophie, Soph, hey, Soph! What the heck? Sophie Louise Sampson, you cannot ignore me forever! <gasps> Bestie! Stop ignoring me! Come on! I'm sorry, I didn't mean for any of this to happen! Yeah, right! No, I'm serious, please, Sophie. Our friendship means the world to me. I would never want to hurt you. I don't know, Brett. Come on, please. Remember our bestie promise we made? We were like in kindergarten when we came up with it. <sighs> yeah, and our promise said that we'd have each other's back until the end of time. Exactly, come on, please, Sophie. Forgive me. Oh, bestie, you know, as much as I want to, I can't stay mad at you forever. That's a spirit. Whoa. Okay, girly pop, you need to play the lottery because you're the luckiest person in the world. Do you know how hard it is to get struck by lightning twice? Wait, hold on. So, so think of something R real quick. Oh my gosh. Yes, it worked. I, I can't hear a single thing. I think my psychic powers are gone. Wait, hold on, hold on. You think I can get hit by lightning next to be psychic? Please, please, please. Come on, Mother Nature. Strike me. Uh, yeah, so I, I don't know about that. Oh, come on. No, let's go. I think we should probably get out of this storm. Hi, everyone. Psst, Brett, it's time for you to go. You're going to be late. Oh, my gosh, no. I totally forgot all about school. Don't worry. I'll distract the paparazzi. Thanks. Remember, no one in school can find out I'm famous. I gotta go. Oh, paparazzi. Look at me. Woo, woo, over here. Woohoo! Best manager in the business. Hey, wait a minute. Where is Brittany going? I'm gonna follow her. I'll get the exclusive story. I hope I'm not too late. Brittany, there you are. Just in time for your presentation. Yes! Oh, class is over! Brittany, please stay behind. I'd like to talk to you. No! Hey, Mr. Jackson, you said you wanted to speak with me? Yes, as a matter of fact, I do. Was it about my presentation? I'm sorry, I get really nervous when I speak in public. No, I demand to know why you are always late. Oh my gosh, my dog ate our key to the car and it, it just, it took a while for my mom to find the spare and it was a whole mess. You used that excuse last week. You think I'm buying this? Look, I'm really sorry, Mr. Jackson. I promise this will never never happen again. Good, or else I'll have to talk to the principal and get you kicked out of school. What? No, I can't be kicked out. Then show up on time. I will, I'm sorry. No, I can't be kicked out of school again. That would be awful. <gasps> Wait, the time. No, I gotta leave early. Oh, I gotta change really, really quick. Okay, 
perfect. I look great. Now I can't let anyone in school see me. I'm gonna be late for my audition. Today is not a good day for me. Everything is going by too soon. Perfect. There's my driver. See anyone around? Gotta get out of here. This is weird. Why is Britt leaving school early? And since when is she being picked up in a G-Wagon? Something's up. Hey guys, I'm home. Brittany dear, that's great. Sit down. We're just about to eat. <gasps> you saved me a taco from Taco Tuesday? Thank you, Mom. But don't mention it. Now, dear, how was your audition? It went pretty well, I think. I should be hearing back soon if I get the part or not. I'm so proud of you, Britt. Thanks, Mom. So has anyone at this new school recognized you yet, Britt? No, not yet, which is awesome. Good, because I am not moving again. It's not fair. I'm sorry, Brenda. I can't help it. But it's for our own good. If people start to recognize me, then we need to go to a new place. Well, it's not fair. I'm sick of your fame ruining my life. If I have a famous sister, I want to at least be able to brag about it, not run all the time. Ugh, I can't stand you, Brittany. You know, I hate to say it, but your sister's right. All this moving is a lot. Are you sure you just don't want to tell people you're famous? Get it over with? No way. I'm not letting people know I'm famous. They're all gonna treat me different. Well, we'll just have to deal with it. So stupid. Ah! Oh my gosh, no, 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 no. Oh, Brittany, dear, oh, I think it's the paparazzi. What? How do they find us? I don't know. I got to go hide. I can't know I'm home. Hey there, can I have a small coffee, please? Yeah, of course. But wait a second. I, I recognize you. Who, me? Yeah, I've seen you like on TV before. You're famous, right? Oh, no, <laughs> I'm sorry. You must have me mistaken. Oh my gosh, no, 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 it's totally you. I completely recognize you now. Oh my gosh, you are so famous. I love your movies. Ah! I have to tell everyone. Wait, wait, no, 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 please. Can I just have that coffee? Everyone, a famous person is here. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh, this is so exciting. I'm like your biggest fan. Oh, no, I'm I'm not who you think I am. I'm just a normal person. You're looking for a coffee? Please, can I have that coffee? I recognize you. You're in my algebra class, aren't you? Um, uh, look over there, a uh, bird. It, it's not me. I'm not a famous person. Gosh, I gotta get out of here. Hey, get back here. Hey, famous girl. I want your autograph. All right, now I'm assigning a group project. Oh, 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 I get to be partners with Brett, right? Please, please, please. I need to be partners with my best friend. No, I get to decide all the partners for this project. You're not the teacher. Sit down. Oh, man never get to have any fun. Just randomizing the list of names? Perfect. Here we are. I hope I get a good partner. Brittany, your partner's with Maddie. Maddie, your partner's with Brittany. Sophie, you get to work with Kevin. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. All right, everyone got their partner assignments? Class dismissed. Hey, Maddie, I'm really excited to be your partner. Well, you better pull your weight with this project. Oh, well, yeah, of course I will. It's a partner project. We gotta do it evenly. Well, I know you miss a lot of school. So I don't want to fail this. I won't let you down. Good. But I know something's going on with you. So tell me now. Whoa. What? What are you talking about? I heard a rumor that you were giving out autographs at the bakery the other day. What? No, uh, that, that wasn't me. You must have someone mistaken for, for me. Whatever. Let's meet at your house for the project tonight. We have a lot to go over. Oh my gosh. Brett, Brett, this is it. I got the worst partner ever. He still picks his nose and eats it. Oh, gross. Yikes. I'm sorry, Soph. I know. What am I going to do? Let's hope he doesn't flick his boogers at me. Wish I was partners with you. Family meeting right away. Dear, what is wrong? Yeah, Brittany. <laughs> no need to yell. What is it? Make it quick. We have a code red. I have a partner coming over to work on my school project, and we have to make sure that we say nothing about about me being famous. Ugh, this again? This is so annoying. <laughs> well, this'll be easy. I'll just go watch the hockey game in my office. Have a good night, ladies. Let's pray they don't go into overtime again. Hey, Mom, if my manager calls, please make up some kind of excuse or, or let her know that I have a normal person here and I'm very busy. I'll try my best, dear. Ah! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, guys, 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 that's her. Mom, promise, just act normal. Dear, I'm always normal. Oh, I don't know about that. I 
Oh, my family doesn't blow my cover. Okay, here we go. Um, hey, Maddie, you made it. Yeah, I told you I'd be here. This is your house. Oh, yeah, <laughs> come on in. Make yourself at home. Hmm, interesting. Small house for a famous person. Wait, what did you just say? <laughs> Never mind. Come upstairs. Uh, let's go work in my room. Here we are. Hmm, interesting. Now let's get started on that project. I'll just shut the door. <laughs> my sister can blast her music sometimes, and it's so loud. Google didn't say anything about you having a sister. What? You Googled me? Nothing. Now, where's our book? Oh, I think I put it over here. Oh, no, I thought I put my phone on silent. What was that? Oh, um, <laughs> nothing. Uh, Britt, you're getting like a ton of DMs. Oh, that, uh, it's probably Sophie just, um, spamming me. She does that all the time. Hmm. Now, well, uh, let's get started. Brittany, there you are. <gasps> Oh my gosh, I've been trying to get a hold of you. Not now, Sam, I'm a little busy. Um, who's this? But Brittany, the audition. Audition? What is she talking about, Britt? Oh, um, uh, it's uh, for choir practice. Yeah, <laughs> choir practice. Britt, what are you talking about? Yeah. Oh, uh, look, I'm sorry, Maddie, I gotta go. I promise I'll do my half of the work and we can meet tomorrow, okay? Yeah, okay, whatever. Britt, hurry up, we must go. See you later, Maddie. I, I gotta get changed. Fabulous news, Brittany. You are perfect for the part. I couldn't have dreamed of a better actress. What? Seriously? Oh, this is so exciting. I know. As the world's top director, it is an honor for you to even be considered for my movie. I know. It's a dream come true to work together. Thank you so much for giving me the chance. Of course. Now, your filming schedule will be quite tough. A lot of long days, crazy hours. Don't worry. I'll make it work. Well, Brittany, we've got to go. You have a lot of other casting appointments. Oh, yes. Well, thank you again. Yes, thank you. We'll be in touch. Of course. Have a wonderful day. Thank you. Gosh, this is so exciting. I can't believe I got the part. Brittany, as your manager, I am so proud of you. You got the role of a lifetime. I know. I'm so excited. Working with this director is everything. Yes, yes, it is. Um, But I was wondering, who in the world was that nerd at your house? Oh my gosh, speaking of which, you almost blew my cover. Oh, it's fine. I told you, if another one of your classmates learns that you're famous, it's okay. Because there's no way just one girl at school could expose your secret. I know, you're right, but I'm really nervous. I don't want to have to leave this school. I kind of like it there. <laughs> don't worry. We could always hire a body double to go to school for you. I gotta get home. It's getting really late. I have to work on that project. <sighs> Brittany. I think we should seriously look into that body double for you. School takes up way too much of your time. That's crazy. It's so important to go to school. Ugh, it was just a suggestion. I know, but we gotta go. It is so late. Oh, I'm exhausted, but I can't let Maddie down. I gotta work on this project. Oh, I can barely keep my eyes open. Oh, I'm, just, I'm just gonna take a little nap. Oh, oh my gosh. Wait, did I fall asleep at my desk? Oh, no, 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 no. I thought I was just taking a nap. Now it's the morning. Maddie's gonna be so mad at me. I've done nothing on our project. Brittany, dear, hurry up. You'll be late for school. Oh my gosh, this is terrible. This is terrible. I gotta change and get to school right away. I'm so totally late. I'm gonna get in so much trouble. <coughs> Ah, um, hi there. Hello. Where is your hall pass? I'm sorry, I, I don't have one. Late loser, where is your hall pass? Hey, don't call me a loser. Well, only losers are late for school. I can't even look you in the eye. To the principal's office, get a late slip immediately. Come on, you gotta be kidding. Just, just let me go. I'm gonna be super late. You should have thought about that when you decided to walk into school late. Now go get a hall pass. Oh my gosh, okay, whatever. Don't do whatever, my lady. Those home monitors are crazy. Um, excuse me, principal? Oh, hello, Brittany. How's it going? Um, good. Can I ask you for a late slip? What? Brittany, this is the fourth time in one week. You've got to get it together. Look, I've just been working 
really, really late, and I'm sorry. I don't care. You need to get it together or else you'll be kicked out. I don't care if you're famous or not. Rules are rules. You have to follow them. Quintel Meanston, shh, can you please? Down. I don't want anyone out there to know that I'm famous. And, uh, that's my problem how? You promised you'd protect my secret when I got here. Yeah, uh, yeah, uh, whatever. Here, take this late slip and get to class. Thank you, Principal Meanston. I really appreciate it. All right, do you want to be even later? Uh, you're right. I gotta go. Yes, it's lunchtime. I'm so ready for lunch. I'm starving. Hi there. I'd like to buy a lunch today. Of course. Wait a second, don't I know you? I've seen you before. Oh, well, yeah, I buy lunch here like almost every day. Nope, I've seen you in the movies. Oh, no, I get that a lot. It, it, it's someone that looks just like me, but it, it's really not me. It most definitely is. Um, I, I think I'll go for the hamburger today. Thank you very much. Can I get your autograph? No, 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 you can't, it's not me. Jeez, how come everyone notices me. Not by changing my hair and my outfit, no one would know that it's actually me. Hey, Britt. Oh, um, hey, Maddie. Do you have your papers for the project? Oh, actually, uh, really bad news. My dog ate my homework. What? Seriously, Britt? Real funny. We're gonna fail if you don't do your job. I'm sorry. It's just, uh, wire practice ran late. Yeah. Britt, you are seriously the worst partner ever. I'm gonna fail and it's all gonna be your fault. Howdy, folks. Whoa, Sophie, what are you doing? Eh, I'm meeting with Kevin for my project. In a hazmat suit? Girl, have you seen the way that boy sneezes? You better believe I'm wearing a hazmat suit. Ooh, his germs are terrifying. Oop, gotta go. Catch you later, Britt. All right, Britt, I'll give you one more chance. Just don't let me down. I promise. I'll make it up to you. And, and we'll get a really good grade. We better. She's literally the worst partner in the world. I'm doing all the work. So, what do you want me to do about it? I want a new partner. Brittany is terrible. Look, I'm not gonna just replace your partner because you don't like her. Wait a second. Is that Maddie talking to Miss Haskins? It is. Yeah, but Brittany's a liar, and I don't work with liars. Hey, wait a second. Are, are you talking? about me? Oh, Britt, perfect. I'm glad you're here. Maddie's been trying to replace you as a partner. Only because you're literally the worst partner ever. Maddie, I said I was sorry. I'll make it up to you. I was just like, one day. Look, girls, I don't care about this at all. Drama is drama. And this grade is 50% of your overall grade for this semester. So if you fail, you'll have to stay back in school. What? Stay back? Then I have to get a new partner. I'm not working with her. Well, the other alternative is to be kicked out. What? No, 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 no. I cannot be kicked out of another school. I mean, uh, not another school, but, um, oops. Look, get your life together. Figure it out. Chase kids these days. Brent, you heard Mrs. Haskins. You gotta work with me on this. I'm not failing. I know, I know, Maddie. I'm really sorry. And what are you talking about being kicked out again? Uh, oh, look at the time. Uh, it's time for cheer practice, even though I'm not even on the cheerleading squad. <laughs> gotta go. Why does she keep lying? I'm gonna figure this out. Brittany has a secret, and I will expose her. <laughs> oh my gosh, I don't believe it. That is seriously such a random fact about ants. I know. Oh, they usually just gross me out, but the fact that they can gossip? Yeah, it's kind of cool. You know, Maddie, I'm actually having a really good time with you. Yeah, Brett, me too. Actually, doing work together has been a lot of fun. I know. Hold on, let me go see if they have another book on ants. Hmm, I'm not seeing anything. Keep looking, I'm sure there's something. Eh, can't find anything. Let me take a look. Wait, Brett, are you serious? There's a book right here. Wait, how did I miss that? I'm not good with the Dewey Decimal System. <laughs> oh, no, you definitely aren't. But hey, I'm sorry what I said earlier. Maybe you're not the worst partner in the world. Oh, thanks. Yeah, I mean, I'm really trying hard and I'm sorry too. I just hope Miss Haskins doesn't fail us because we annoyed her. Girl, you're telling me that teacher has no time for no one. <laughs> It's true. Oh, hey, Maddie, uh, hold on a second. I gotta get this. Hello? Wait, no, I can't. I'm busy right now. 
You can't be serious. What? No! Okay, okay, okay. I'll figure it out. See you soon. Bye. Oh, what's going on? What was that? No! Wait, Patty, I I'm really sorry, but I gotta get going. Seriously? You're leaving again? We were just getting started. Yeah, I know, but it's something really, really urgent. Is everything okay? Um, it's my, uh, cat. Yeah, Mr. Paws. He's being rushed to the vet right now. Wait, aren't you allergic to cats? Uh, I, I gotta go. Sorry, Maddie. Ugh, I've had it. I can't take Brittany's lies anymore. I'm gonna follow her. Hey, oh my goodness. I'm so sorry I'm late. Yeah, you should be sorry. The director is mad. They were just about to cancel. Cancel? No! Well, I'm here now. And we don't have much time to waste. Let's get moving. Do you remember your lines? Of course I do. Great, right this way. There you are. Took you long enough. I'm so sorry. Uh, there was traffic and my cat had to go to the hospital. Yeah. Oh, no. That's terrifying. Well, let's get ready to film. Quiet on set, everybody. I'll take my place. Great. And rolling in three, two, one. Action. And cut. Oh, fantastic, Brittany. Fabulous job. Yes, perfect, Brittany. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> that was fun. And again, I'm so sorry I'm late. Yes, well, just don't make it happen again. That's a wrap. Hold on a second. Sorry, I excuse me. Maddie, what are you doing? Uh, ah, there you go! Wait, oh my gosh, hold on. I thought this was a closed set. Guys, did you see that girl that was here? What are you talking about? Brit, <laughs> let's act like we normally do on set. Oh my gosh, no, this, this is not good. Maddie, Maddie, where are you? No, did she follow me? Did she like take pictures of me acting? This isn't good. This isn't good. My secret can't be exposed. <laughs> Perfect. And send. Now everyone's going to know we have a famous person in our school. I knew Brittany was up to no good. <laughs> wow, no way. She's famous. Y'all, that's sick. Wait, Britt's famous? <gasps> I don't believe it. I'm calling my mom. Whoa, crazy. There's a famous person in our school. I never knew that. Yo, I knew she was famous. There was something about her. I'm gonna ask her out on a date now. <laughs> then I'm gonna be famous too. Oh, uh, hey guys. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. It's you. Oh, this is so exciting. Our very own celebrity. Yo, Britt, what's up? Can I be in one of your movies? Oh no, oh no, oh no. Um, what are you guys talking about? Where's the celebrity? I I, I don't see one. <laughs> it's you, Britt. Yeah. Oh my gosh. No, 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 no. This can't be happening. Well, well, well. If it isn't our famous Brittany. Maddie, it was you. You did this. Of course it was me. I sent everyone footage from your commercial last night. I knew you were a liar. And I'm not going to fail because of you. Wait, Maddie, this isn't fair. This is my secret. I had no right to tell everyone. <laughs> Well, now everybody knows it. Come on, Britt. Give me an autograph. Yeah, come on. Oh, come on, Britt. Hey, Britt, smile for the camera. What? No, the paparazzi's here. But we want to see you at school. Come on, come on. Just one picture. Just one picture. No, people weren't supposed to know that I'm famous. I got to get out of here. Get back here, Brittany. Please, hold on. Smile for the camera. I'm so glad I don't have a cold anymore. I hate missing school. Oh my gosh, don't look now. But it's Brit. I can't believe she broke up Carson and Bailey. I would hate to be friends with her. Why is everyone talking about me? None of this is true. Young lady, I expelled you from school. Get out immediately before I call the police. What did I do? You know exactly what you did. Out! Ah! Was I expelled? I wasn't even at school yesterday. <laughs> what the? Who are you? And why do you look just like me? I'm your twin sister, Bethany. I'm sure your dad would love to tell you all about me. <laughs> Hold the phone. I have a twin sister? Since when? Why didn't I ever know about this? And is she the reason why I got expelled from school? No, 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 no. This can't be happening. This is like a crazy nightmare or something. I gotta get home and talk to my dad. He sure has some explaining to do. Dad! Dad! Oh, hey there, kiddo. Is there a holiday that I didn't know about? Tell me the truth right now. Do I have a twin sister? Uh... Hello! Earth to dad! Yeah, you do have a twin sister. She lives with your mother. 
I was actually gonna introduce you to her. And when were you planning on doing that? Come on in, it's open. Dad, this is crazy. I can't believe you kept a secret that I have a twin. Well, believe it because here I am. Ah! Oh geez, Brittany, relax. It's like you've never seen yourself before. <laughs> Get it, you're twins, you look identical. Yeah, sis, what's the matter? You're awfully jumpy. I'm not jumpy, I'm just trying to process right now. And what are you doing here? Well, Britt, meet your twin, Bethany. Dad, we've already met. She's the reason I was expelled from school. Oh, come on. That's not true, Brittany. I just got here and you're already accusing me of things? Not so sisterly, huh? You've got expelled from school? I thought I raised my daughter better than that. But, Dad. No buts. We'll discuss this later. Now, Brittany, show Bethany to your room. You guys will be sharing while Bethany stays with us for the week. And I'm off to go run some errands. Catch you later. Perfect. Now show me to our room, sis. I'm sorry, not to be rude, but why are you even here? Why are you staying at her house? Well, our mother won a trip to Bora Bora, and she chose to bring her boyfriend instead of me. Oh, man. I'm sorry. Just consider yourself lucky you don't live with her. Follow me this way. And I'm sure we could fit like an air mattress in here somewhere. Make it super cozy. Hmm, no. This is actually my room now and I'm kicking you out. Wait, what? Yeah, you heard me. Get out, get out, whoa, get out, whoa, get out. Whoa. Yes, oh, okay, oh my gosh, what the heck? Bethany? Later, loser. <gasps> she locked me out. Hello, hello, hey, open up, open up. Bethany, I don't believe this. Having a twin is supposed to be really, really cool. I've always wanted one. But now that my real twin sister's here and ruining my life, how are we supposed to get along? It's fine. Maybe I can use the time to go back to school and try to figure out how to get unexpelled. Is that even a thing? I hope so. I am never going to forgive you, Brittany. You broke me and Mason up. Oh my gosh, Bailey, it wasn't me. It was my twin sister. I'm not stupid, Brittany. If you had a twin, she would go to school here too, but she doesn't. You're the worst. <laughs> oh my gosh, what do I do? Nobody at school knows that I'm a twin and right now I need to prove it to everyone. I didn't do any of these crazy things that I'm getting in trouble for. I just have to figure out a way to prove to people that I do have a twin. All right. Let me go try to talk to the principal. Excuse me, Principal Sanchez? Oh, what? No, uh-uh, no, absolutely not, Susan! Call school security! Oh, no, Miss Susan, don't call school security! Sanchez, I didn't do anything wrong. It was my twin, I promise. You don't have a twin, Brittany. I would know if you did. Trust me, I know everything. No, no, I know this sounds absolutely crazy, but I didn't know I had a twin up until a few hours ago. But I'm telling you, she's the one that caused all of these problems. I can't believe that you, a straight A student, is lying to me right now. Well, if you don't believe me, call my dad then. I'm sure he can explain it. Very well. Let me get him on the telephone. Hello, Mr. Blaze? Brittany's here in my office, and she is telling me that she has a twin. Yeah, it's very much true. Her name is Bethany. Bye-bye. He said you have a twin. Ha! Huh. I mean, um, sorry. <laughs> all right, you're officially welcome back to school. If I find out that all this is one big lie and you got your dad on your side to help lie for you, I will ensure you are not allowed within a hundred yards of this school. Oh my gosh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Like, gosh, you're the best. I don't care what anyone says about you. You're not that awful. What did you just say? Uh, nothing. Gotta go to class. Bye. Yes. Oh, I can't believe it. I'm so excited to be back at school. Oh, yes. Now maybe I can set the record straight. Wait a second. I'm getting a text? It's from Bethany. She's asking if we have SPF 500 sunscreen because she's having a beach day? Oh my gosh, no. I I'm telling her I- She said she doesn't have time for me. I'm her twin sister. And she's back at school? What the heck? Did I do all that sabotaging for nothing? Not on my watch. Guess no more pool day for me. I got some more work to do. Hi, I'm Brittany. Ooh. Ah! No, I gotta get out of here. The criminal's back! Whoa, what the? What has Mr. Corkski all upset? Master! 
Hey! Hey, girly. Hey, Soph. I cannot believe you blew up the science lab before me. Do you know it's gonna cost the school $50,000 to repair all the damages you caused yesterday? Yeah, Soph, but it wasn't me. It was my twin. <laughs> All right, yeah, okay. Bestie, I've known you since kindergarten. If I would know if you had a twin. <laughs> no, I'm not lying. I found out today. Apparently, she has been living with my mom this entire time, and I knew nothing about it. Weird that your dad never mentioned anything. Yeah, he doesn't really like to talk about my mom that much. I guess they got into a big fight over what baseball team was better years ago, and they've never been able to, like, reconcile. I, I don't know. But according to my dad, she's not a great person. And it kind of seems that way, seeing as my twin sister's terrible. Yikes, girly pop. That sounds awful. Tell me about it. Hey, Brittany! Oh! Uh, hey, Carson, what, what's up? You still up for our date now that me and Bailey are broken up? Um, excuse me? Yeah, you told me if I called it quits with Bailey, then you'd go out with me. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. That was my twin sister. It wasn't me. Oh, come on, Britt. Stop playing hard to get. I'll buy you lunch. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait a second, Carson. Britt has a boyfriend. Now beat it. What? Whatever. I broke up with Bailey, who I've been with for two years for you. So I hope you change your mind. Oh, boy. Your twin really did some damage on the one day that she was here. Can I meet her? I want to know who she buys her snakes from. I'm in the market for one. Wait, so what the heck are you talking about? Snakes. <laughs> oh, yeah. She put a bunch of snakes through the ventilation ducts in the school, and animal control is still here trying to find them all. Snakes! <laughs> See? <laughs> la, 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 la. Surprise. What do you think of my new look? Ah, Bethany, what are you doing here? Going to school as you, duh. Minus those ugly headphones. You really have awful taste. Okay, Bethany, I don't really get what's going on here. Why are you trying to impersonate me? Can't you be yourself and stop ruining my life? No way. My mom taught me that if you want to have fun in life, you've got to make other people's lives miserable. You know that's simply not true. Oh, yeah? Speak for yourself. There's the bell. Gotta run. Can't be late for geometry. Hey, no running in the halls. Whatever. Bethany, Bethany, get back here. No running in the halls. Wait, hold up. Weren't you just... Um, sorry. Gotta go. Bethany, stop. What do you think you're doing? I'm going to class as Brittany so I can keep ruining your life and no one will know that it's secretly your twin sister. No, I'm not gonna let you do this. <laughs> Fine then, have it your way. Hey, put me down. What are you doing? Bethany. Later. Hey, Carson, hey. Bethany, did she seriously lock me in the janitor's closet? Somebody. Okay, next best thing, phone. You gotta be kidding me. And there's literally no service. Hold on. Sophie had a secret room in a janitor's closet. And maybe it's this one? Yes, yes! This is amazing! And also kind of really, really cool. Let me log on to her PC and see if I can send her a message real quick. Dear Sophie, please come to your secret room and let your best friend out. I'm locked in here. Signed, yours truly, your bestie, forever and ever, Brit. Send! Oh my gosh, thank pineapples! Thanks, Soph. Now I gotta go stop Bethany because who knows what she could be up with. Later! Um, you're welcome! Bethany, not cool. <laughs> hey, sis, I totally bombed that geometry test. Shapes are hard. Who would have thought? Did you take my test and fail it on purpose? Yeah, stinks to be you. Wait, there's Carson! Hey, Carson! Oh my gosh, no, I couldn't make this right. Hey, um, excuse me? Hi, Tower? Yes, what is it? Um, I'm sorry, but I was actually wondering if I could retake that test I just did. The one you literally just turned in? Yeah, but it wasn't me who took it. It was my twin sister. Oh, come on. I've heard that one before. Now go get to your next class. You're interrupting my free 30-minute period. Miss Hightower, I'm not lying. Get out of here. Go, go, go. go. Oh, my. Okay. Oh, failure. Great. Now I'm just going to have failing grades. What am I supposed to do? Oh, so now you're going on a date with Carson? Are you kidding me, Britt? Wait, no, Bailey. It's not me. It's my twin, Bethany. Snake!
think if it's your twin, then why don't you go and get her? Gladly. Bethany, hold on. Oh my gosh. No, I don't even know where she is. That's because you don't have a twin. No, no, I do. How about you come over to my house later and I, I can prove it to you. Okay, fine. But you owe me a pair of the Grimace Crocs if you're lying because you stole my boyfriend. You have a deal. Good. Text me your address and I'll meet you after school. You better not be lying. Brad! Oh my gosh, you won't believe it. They're letting me keep one of the snakes. What should I name him? Bethany is literally destroying my life. Hmm, I think that's a little too long to be a name for a snake. Okay, okay, she should be here any second now. School ended two hours ago, Britt. If your so-called twin doesn't show up in two Hello. minutes. Hello, I'm home. Bethany, I'm so glad to see you. Where have you been? Out shopping. How did you buy all of that? <laughs> I never said I paid for anything. Wait, did you steal all of that? Just like you stole my boyfriend? Um, I don't know. Maybe if he actually liked you, he wouldn't have broken up with you so fast. Oh my gosh, Bethany. That's awful of you to say. Yeah, whatever. Now, excuse me. I have a date with Carson tonight and I need to freshen up. Oh, no, you don't. Give me back my boyfriend. Sorry. Can't hear you over your ugliness. Bye. <laughs> oh my gosh, Bethany. This is literally the worst day of my life. Oh my gosh, I am so sorry about my twin. No one deserves to be spoken to that way. It's not your fault. You know what? If you help me deal with my twin sister, I'll help you get your boyfriend back. <laughs> really? Absolutely. It feels so nice to be out of that ugly pink sweater. Hey, I like this sweater. Yeah, whatever. Anyways, I got a hot date waiting for me. Speaking of, Bailey, where should I take Carson? I mean, you know him pretty well, and I want to impress him. You should take Carson to get sushi. It's his favorite. And you should talk to him about Mount Everest. He's really obsessed with it for some reason. <gasps> Later, losers. Wow, Bailey, you're actually helping Bethany? No way. Carson hates sushi, and he thinks that anyone that talks about Mount Everest is secretly an alien trying to infiltrate his brain. What? Oh my gosh, that's amazing. And kind of crazy. She's still my boyfriend, so I'm definitely not helping her. You know, Bailey, I think you would probably get along really well with my best friend, Sophie. Oh, the girl that wears the hazmat suit every Friday the 13th to protect herself from evil spirits? Yep, that's the one. Yeah, honestly, we'd probably be close friends. Invite her over. Also, I'm sorry, Britt, for not believing you when you said you had a twin. Oh, don't worry about it. All I hope is that she doesn't cause any more problems. It's been really fun hanging out together, Bailey. Yeah, I know. Sorry I hated you before. Oh, no worries. You, you little snake. Oh, what's wrong, Bethany? Carson hates sushi. I also had to walk five miles because he thought I was an alien when I asked him about Mount Everest. So he ran off crying, my phone died, and I couldn't even call an Uber. Sorry, Bethany, that's real unfortunate. Did you know about this? No, 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 not, not me. Oh, I'm gonna make sure you both pay for this. Yikes, she seems real mad. Did they go too far, Britt? I don't think so. She is still your boyfriend, Bailey. She went too far. Yeah, you're right. I think I'm gonna go. Later, Britt. See you at school. Hmm. Now that Bailey mentioned it, it kinda did seem like Bethany was real mad. I mean, did I cross the line? To be fair, she's the one who's been crossing the line. I definitely need a little bit of a snack. Hey, kid, how's it going? Oh, hey, Dad, quick question. When does Bethany go home again? At the end of this week, why? Oh, just curious. All right, well, hey, I'm going out to do karaoke with the boys. Don't stay up too late. You have school tomorrow. I'll leave money on the counter for pizza. Wish me luck. I'm gonna sing Taylor Swift. <laughs> I've been practicing all week. Uh, bye, Dad. Good luck. Realized my dad was such a Swifty. Oh, well. Pizza does sound good, though. I'm not gonna lie. Excuse me. Oh, hey, Bethany, I was just about to order a pizza. What are you doing with that trash bag? Taking your things to the junkyard. Wait, what? No, no. Hey, <laughs> hold on. Get back here. Here, Bethany, what are you doing? Later. What? No, no, hey, Bethany, get back here. What the heck? That's my car. And you can't take my things and throw them in the dumpster. Oh my gosh. What was she doing in my room? Oh, I gotta go check. <gasps> my room. Where are all my things? That's so messy. 
What did Bethany do? Oh my gosh. Nasty! Hey! <laughs> Sorry, my girls. I lost my new pet snake and I had to go find him. Sophie, I'm so glad you're here. I really upset Bethany and I think now she's back to ruining my life again. Oh boy. What did you do? Bethany, there you are. Where is my car? At the bottom of the lake. How'd you do that? It's not my first rodeo. Whoa, can we be friends? What? Sophie! Yeah, absolutely not, because you're associated with Brittany, and I don't trust anyone that's friends with her. Hey! Ah, come on, Brittany's pretty cool in my opinion. Yeah, okay, whatever. You know what? Sophie has a good idea. How about we hang out together for, like, just a day, just to see if you like it? I mean, we're sisters. We're supposed to get along. No, thanks. Wait, wait, no, no, no. I'll pay for everything. Now you're talking. Fine. You're taking me to the mall tomorrow after we get out of school. Deal. So, uh, I guess we're all hanging out tomorrow, huh? Um, yeah. Yeah, I, I guess so. I don't know where I was going with this plan, but we're here now. So I'm thinking about getting another snake. Sophie, are you wanting to give your mom a heart attack or something? You could barely keep track of that one snake. Yeah, but he seems lonely. Hey, girls. Oh, hey, Bailey, what's up? Is uh, Bethany at school today? I'm so scared after what she said last night. No, she's not here. You don't have to worry about her. It's okay. We talked, and I don't think she's that mad anymore. And you know what? I decided I'm not going to get back with Carson after all. Girl, say what? After all that, really? Well, yeah. He broke up with me after two years of dating. Like it was nothing. Then immediately started dating another girl. What a jerk. Ooh, you go, girl. You know what? That's the spirit. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Um, come on, Bailey. Take me back. Uh, I love you. These flowers, they're pretty and they remind me of you. Oh, so this is awkward. Get away from me, Carson. But, but Bailey, she meant nothing to me. Dude. Your twin has been here for two days, and she's done more damage than I've ever done in my life. Yeah, tell me about it. Uh, I just hope that this afternoon's hangout sesh goes well. Me too, bestie. Me too. Hey, let's go into this store. They have such cute things. Hey, Blondie, get out of my store. I'm calling the cops. Whoa. Um, hey, friends. On second thought, let's not go in there. Chase Louise, what's their deal? Oh, <laughs> that's probably my bad. I sold two thousand dollars worth of clothes from there yesterday you did what that's my favorite store and that's my problem because because you can't do that stealing is wrong and besides everyone at school thinks that i'm the one behind the craziness and now that you're doing this around town the whole town's gonna think that i'm the worst yeah so dude are there any stores you haven't stolen from yet uh we might have to go a town over dude you've been here for two days I don't get it. You're acting like I did something wrong. <sighs> Let's head over to the place that I work at and grab some smoothies. Um, <laughs> about that. Uh, you're not welcome there either. Wait, what? Did you get me fired? Yeah, I got you fired because you were texting on the clock and stealing product. Oh my gosh, that is awful. Okay, now what? Okay, this is a total bust. Yeah, maybe I can get a new job at the arcade. Ooh, band. Sorry. What? The nail salon? And the hair salon? And oh my pineapples. Britt, you're basically gonna have to move now because you're banned from literally everywhere. <laughs> you're welcome. Well, since you've gotten me banned from literally everywhere, how about we play some video games? Ew, I hate video games. <laughs> what? I'm sorry. They're boring and tacky. We're supposed to be twins, which means we come from the same family. And my family loves gaming. And there will be no gaming slander in this home. Yeah, bro, don't knock it till you try it. I think we should play just dance. Put it on. That's one of my faves. Um, I think I'm going to pass. Hey, no, no, Bethany. Can you at least give it a chance? I mean, you kind of owe me big time. Ugh, fine. Yay! I got first. Woo! Yeah, get dancing, girl. Woo! Hold on, wait, pause. Oh man, I got a text from my mom. My snake got out again. I gotta run. Doesn't Sophie have a cage for that thing? I don't know. My turn to pick an activity. Now oh, come on. Where are you going? Down here. In the laundry room? What the heck? Why? <laughs> don't be silly. Walk over to the wall over there. Hold on, wait a second. Is this a secret door? Open it. Okay. <gasps> Wait, Bailey? Brett, 
Oh my gosh, help me! Oh, come on, Britt. Don't help her. Dude, seriously, let her out. No, she sabotaged my date. There's no way. Britt, your twin is crazy. Aw, how sweet of you to say. Hold on, wait, there's a key. Here. What? Hey! No! I can't believe I locked the key! What the heck? You two losers have fun in here. Say goodbye to your social lives. <laughs> Bethany, hey, wait! No! Gotta be kidding. She has us both locked in here. What do you think she's gonna do? I have no idea. Whoa! What's got you all in a rush? Oh, nothing. Don't worry about it, Dad. See ya! <laughs> all right. Girls are so weird. This is pointless. Bethany is just ruining our lives as we speak, and we're stuck in this jail cell. Come on. Don't be worried. We, we won't be stuck in here forever. Think. Help! Help! Come on! Somebody's gonna hear us! Help! 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 Brett? Are you trapped in the walls again? Oh my gosh, it's Sophie! Sophie, yeah, we're in here! Brett! Bailey! Sophie! Bestie, there's a key that I dropped on the floor right out there. Unlock the door! Huh, sweet! Oh my gosh, yes! Wait, hold on. Dad? Whoa, kid! W what's up? You haven't been watching me dance for long, ha have you? No, but Dad, Bethany is actually insane. She had me locked in a cage downstairs. Couldn't you hear me screaming? Uh, sorry. <laughs> I was listening to my tunes. Well, Dad, I need to go stop her before she ruins my life even more. Wait, what's at the door? A box? Uh, I didn't order anything, did you? No. There looks like there's a card and it says goodbye for now. My work here is done? Insert evil laugh? What the? Hey, old lady, hand over the purse. No, no, help somebody, please help me. I said, give me all your money. Oh no, that old lady's in danger. I've got to help her. Oh, no, no. I'm here to help. Take this criminal. Oh, oh my goodness, thank you. You saved me and my millions. Don't mention it, old lady. <gasps> wait a second, what's the time? Oh no, I'm gonna be late for school. I gotta go. Oh no, wait, I have to change. No one at school can know I'm a superhero. Perfect, time for school. Oh my goodness, that was such a close call. I gotta walk in here with my superhero outfit. Bro, hey, bro, what's up? Hey, bestie. Dude, why weren't you in home room this morning? Oh, um, uh, I, uh, I had a doctor's appointment. Yeah, uh, sorry. My bestie, you are always late. You know, one of these days you're gonna get in trouble, you know. Ah, no, I won't. I'll worry about that some other time. I don't know, Brett. Attendance in school is real important. And if you're tardy, <clears throat> no party for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can Brittany please report to the principal's office? Brittany to the principal's office immediately. Ooh, girl, you're in trouble. Wait, no, you don't think I am, do you? I don't know. But good luck! <laughs> so glad it's not me this time. Catch you later, Soph. What could the principal want with me? I hope I'm not in trouble. I hope I'm not in trouble. Excuse me, Principal Meanston, you wanted to see me? Yes, I did. Now take a seat. Um, okay. Did I do anything wrong? Hmm, well, let's see here. I'm pulling up your permanent record. Yep, yep. <laughs> Just as I thought. What is it? You, miss, are going to be kicked out of school if you keep missing another assignment or if you're late again without a note. What? No. Principal Meanson, please, just give me a chance. I'm sorry. Something really important came up. <laughs> Something more important than your education? I don't think so. No, honestly, I mean, even if I told you, you probably wouldn't believe me. Ah, give it a shot. I've been a principal for 25 years. I've heard every excuse in the Okay, well, I'm gonna whisper it to you, but I'm secretly a superhero, and I was off saving an old lady. <laughs> Whoa, that's a good one. <laughs> and I'm secretly a super bottle. <laughs> no, I'm telling the truth, but no one in school can know. Yeah, okay, whatever. I'm gonna give you one more chance, but then you're out of here. Whoa, uh, okay. Now get to class. Go, go. Oh, oh, you're right. Um, thank you. Oh, wait, why am I saying thank you if he's gonna throw me out of school? Oh, I don't believe this. All right, class, today we're running hurdles, kids. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Why? Why? No, I hate running more than anything. Um, coach, I, uh, I can't do it. Oh, I, I fell to the ground. I didn't have enough sugar today. Sorry, looks like I can't run. <laughs> nice 
one, Samson. Suck it up. You're running. Oh man. I wanted that to work. All right. Up first is Brittany, Maya, and Sophie. Hurry up. Let's go. Good luck, Brit and Soph. You're gonna need it. <laughs> I'm totally faster than both of you combined. And a three, two, one, go! I think I got this! Whoa! Oh, yeah! Whoa! Wait a second! Look at Brick go! Oh, my goodness! I, I can't believe it! Brittany, you ran so fast! Wait, what? No! That's not fair! Brittany clearly cheated! What? No, I, I just ran! This is unbelievable! I, I gotta go write this time down! It could be a new world record! I could be famous! <laughs> you know what, Brett? I'm on to you. Something's not right. You're like a superhero or something. That was like supersonic speed. You don't know what you're talking about. There's no way. I I'm, I'm not a superhero. That's so silly. Yeah, right. I'm on to you. No, honestly, Maya, I'm I'm not. I just, I, I like running. <laughs> oh, my pineapples. Brett, that was amazing. But I think my legs are broken. Oh my gosh, Soph, are you okay? I think I need to go to the nurse. Oh, it was amazing. I saved four people from a burning building today. Oh, wow, dear, that is great. That's two more people than last week. I love a good burning building save. I do too. Great, dear, how, how was your day? Oh, uh, it was okay. Just okay. Dear, you haven't even touched your turkey leg. What's bothering you? Oh, uh, it's... Nothing, I'm just not really hungry. Hmm, well, all right. It's time for you to go upstairs and suit up. We must work on your superhero training. What? No, I can't, Dad. I have, like, so much homework. Well, homework can wait. You're gonna have to be ready to save the world sooner than later. Your father's right, you know. But if I don't finish all my homework tonight, I could be kicked out of school forever. Well, kid, once your training's done, you can start your homework. Come on. But, Dad, I have, like, a huge book report. And you'll do it later. Come on. Time to suit up. <laughs> okay, kid, it's pretty simple. We'll work on our first move. Normal punch. It goes a little something like this. Oh, Dad, that was crazy. <laughs> All right, it's your turn. Give it a shot. Okay, I hope I can do this. Just focus and you've got it. Ready, go. <laughs> <laughs> nice work, nice work. You'll be able to take on villains in no time. You think? Yeah. Now how about we try an uppercut? Goes a little something like this. Oh, awesome. Okay, I'll give it a whirl. <laughs> That's it. Ah, this is awesome. What's next? A classic shove. No villain will get away from this. See? Simple. Dad, that one's kind of boring. Yeah, yeah, but hey. <laughs> All right. Ha! Great job. <laughs> Kid, you're getting the hang of it. You'll be taking on those villains in no time. Honestly, though, the first villain I have to tackle is all my homework. <laughs> oh, I'm so... Tired. My legs hurt. I'm walking all weird because they're in pain. Oh, I was up so late practicing my skills last night and then I had to do all my homework and I'm so tired. Oh. Hey, Britt. Oh, hey, Maya. There is something wrong with you. What? It's kind of mean to say. No, I know you're hiding something and I'm going to figure out just what it is. Okay. Why do you think that? Because no normal person can run as fast as you did. It was like you had superpowers. No, I just practiced really hard and I'm naturally fast. No, before the race, I heard you complaining about how much you hate running. I know something's up. I will expose you. You were saved by the bell, Brit. Oh, thank goodness. And another thing. I before E except after C. Attention, Mrs. Haskins. Can we please have Brittany to the secretary's office? She's being dismissed. Wait, I'm being dismissed? That's weird. I wonder why. All right, Brittany. You heard the secretary. But this is suspicious. It's a tenth time this month you've been dismissed from my class. I'm sorry, Mrs. Haskins, but I gotta go. Oh no, I think my parents are dismissing me for another mission. I gotta change. The coast is clear. No one can see me. Wait. Mom, Dad, what's going on? The mayor needs us. The city's under attack. And we need your help. You got it. Let's go. What the heck? Where's Brittany going? Is she a superhero? <laughs> I'll be taking all of this. <laughs> no ordinary person's gonna be able to stop me. <laughs> I'm gonna rule this town. <gasps> Wait a second, what the heck? What are you guys doing here? Mr. Evil, it is time you give up the money. Yeah! <laughs> Back chance. Hand over the money, bud. Yeah, you're gonna have to make me. 
Well, we are gonna have you locked up for a very long time. You think you can stop me? You'll never stop me. Oh, yeah, Mr. Evil. <laughs> Stand no chance. Oh, oh, that is it. Take this. <laughs> is that the best you got? Oh, that was easy, wasn't it? That's it. That's the last straw. I'm gonna take you down. Oh, yeah? How do you plan on doing that, little girl? All right, Mr. Evil, I challenge you to a color block race. The first one to get to the finish line wins. Ha! You're on, kid. Go, go, go. Three, two, one. Woo! Ha! Oh, man, he's good at this. No! <gasps> but not good enough. Goodbye, Mr. Evil. I defeated you. All right, kid, have a great day at school. And I am so proud of you for defeating Mr. Evil. I know, I can't believe it. And that was kind of easy. <laughs> it was only easy because you've been training hard and hard work pays off. Now get along to class. We'll see you at home. Bye, Mom. Bye, Dad. I can't believe that. That was so exciting. I gotta get back inside. I gotta change back into my normal clothes before anyone sees me. It is new. Um, Brett, where are you coming from? Oh, Maya. It's a little nosy. I was dismissed. Oh, yeah? Why are you back so soon? Hmm? Hmm? Well, um, you see, uh, um, uh, oh gosh, um, uh, yeah. So my grandmother, uh, she was rushed to the hospital, but come to find out, she just got a paper cut. So, like, she's good now. Likely story. You're such a liar. No. I'm not a liar. Why did you leave with those superheroes, huh? Oh, that? Um, no, they were my mom and dad, but um, they, uh, um, they had a costume party at work. Yeah. You're full of it. I'm gonna expose you and your lie soon enough. Mark my words. I'm gonna tell the whole school. I can't find out I'm a superhero and she can't tell the whole school. Everyone's gonna treat me differently. I just, I gotta act normal, right? It'll be fine. Hey, Brett! What are you doing, bestie? Are you ready for the math test? Oh my gosh, the math test? I totally forgot to study. Oh, girl. <laughs> that ain't good. If you fail, they might hold you back a year. What? No, Sophie. No, 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 no. That can't happen. I, I can't be held back a year. Or maybe two years. They'll send you back to Haha, uh -huh, so very funny. You never know. It happened to my cousin in San Francisco once. Oh, no! Come on, Bessie! We gotta go! No, no, I can't feel another test. Oh, that was a stressful day. I'm so glad to be done with school, and Soph and I are hanging out. Woo! Hey, Bestie! Oh, yeah. oh, oh. Uh, hey, Brett, what's going on? Oh, nothing. I'm so glad school's over today. Dude, me too. It was the longest school day of my life. Yeah, but at least we had that little break during the day for the book fair. <laughs> Brit, do I seem like a girl who likes reading? Well, um... Absolutely not! Now, come on, let's go to the bakery. Your girl needs a macaroon. Oh, oh, so that actually sounds amazing. I could totally go for a cupcake right now. Let's go, bestie. Wait, wait up, wait up. I'll take a macaroon, please. Oh, and one cupcake for me. Not a problem. Here you go. Sorry we're all out of macaroons. These are display, so they're made of cardboard. Eh, I would have eaten it anyways, but a donut will do. Thanks again. Yeah, thanks. So where do you want to sit? I think over here. Oh, 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 perfect. Um, Britt, hold on. I'm gonna get us some napkins. I'm gonna make a mess. Uh, excuse me, sir. Can my friend and I have some napkins. Of course. <laughs> uh, what's so funny about napkins? You're coming with me. No! no! Get over here. Scary Mella guy. <laughs> Wait a second. Is that Sophie screaming? What's going on? No, did she get a paper cut? I gotta go check on her. Ah! Wait, no! Is that Mr. Evil? Oh, that's it, he kidnapped my best friend. I gotta save her. Oh my gosh, I don't believe it. Mom, Dad, I need you. Oh my goodness, oh, I just don't believe it. Neither do I, dear, neither do I. Mom, Dad, Mr. Evil kidnapped Sophie. <gasps> no, not little Sophie. Oh, I don't believe this. This is insanity. I know, so I need your help saving her. But Brittany, dear, we got a stress signal. It's true. The mayor called and the city is in great danger. We gotta go. We have an obligation. Yeah, but my best friend in the entire world's in danger. Well, kid, time to test out all the skills we've taught you. Yes, 
You can do this. You beat Mr. Evil before, so you could do it again. Good luck, dear. You've got this, kid. Just focus. Oh, no, I can't believe this. I've never really fought someone on my own. My mom and dad have always been there for support. I, I don't know if I can get this done, but I have to save Sophie. I'm just afraid I'm not a good enough superhero. Mr. Evil here. As I'm sure you're aware, I have your best friend. And she is hidden in a place you will never find her. Where are you hiding her? That's for me to know and for you to never find out, superhero Brit. <laughs> Good luck. You're gonna need it. Oh, this is insane. Gotta find Sophie. And fast. Let me go. <laughs> never. If you don't let me go, I'll expose the truth. Oh, yeah? <laughs> And what's the truth? That you look fat in your superhero suit. <laughs> what? Why would you say that? Because I'm being honest. Now let me go. You be quiet at once. Only a superhero can save you. And I doubt they will. But I'm gonna go look in the mirror. I thought I looked nice and toned. I have to find some kind of clue on how to get to that villain's base. I don't know how. I'm gonna just fly around town and, I don't know, see something. There's gotta be clues, right? I just have to find my friend. I can't let anything bad happen to her. Wait a second, what's happening over there? Is that man robbing that store? Oh, what the heck? I don't have time for this. But I'm a superhero, so I gotta make time. No, 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 no. Not so fast, buddy. Oh no, what's going on? I demand you stop what you're doing right this instant. <laughs> yeah, right. What are you gonna do? You're gonna wish you never said that. Oh, that hurt. And I'm gonna have you locked up for that. No, please, please don't do that. Don't do that. If you do, Mr. Evil will lose it and I'll be out of a job. Wait a second, you work for him? <laughs> well, yeah, no kidding, all criminals do. Well, I demand you tell me where his base is. No, why would I ever do that? Absolutely not. Nope, 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 nope. Don't make me power blast you into next year. Ah! Whoa, oh gosh, okay, oh, fi fine, fine, fine. Here, right this way. All right, you have to punch through this wall. Only the strongest punch will get you through to the villain's lair. Good luck, <laughs> you're gonna need it. Okay, I've been training for this. How hard could it be? Ah! Oh, power blast, yes! How much longer am I gonna have to punch for? Yes! Ha! I made it through. Wait a second. What's going on? Whoa! Whoa! Wait! What the heck? I was just like teleported to this crazy place. This lab is. I don't know. I'm kind of nervous, but I can't be nervous. Brittany, you gotta stay strong. You gotta save your friend. She's counting on you. I can do this. I'm a superhero. I was like born to do this. Whoa. Lace. Crazy. Talk about a secret lab, but also talk about lack of security. A villain doesn't have like a guard or something at the door. Maybe they're on lunch. I recognize those purple lights. That was from this video. <gasps> Sophie! Oh my gosh, there you are! <laughs> Misty! Are you okay? No! It'd be a lot better if I was out of the scary tube. I'm getting claustrophobic. Oh wait, wait a second. Uh, Brent, what are you? Wearing. Oh, uh, this, um, well, uh, yeah, um, uh, Brett, are you a- Shh, Sophie, we don't have time to talk. I gotta get you out of here before Mr. Evil comes back. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Ah, it's you, freeing my friend. Ha, 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 yeah, okay. What's so funny, Mr. Evil? You're just a weak superhero. You can't stop me. Oh, hey, ho, oh. ho. Whoa. Dude. Thanks, Sophie. Now, come on. We gotta get you out of here. But are we gonna talk about the fact that you, um, well... No, Soph! We're running. Come on! But I really wanna address the elephant in the room. Nope. No time. Oh, that brat thinks she could get away. <laughs> And this isn't the last she's gonna see of me. Oh my gosh, that was a close call, huh, Soph? Mm-hmm, sure was. What's wrong, Bestie? You kept a secret from me, dude. And like, a pretty big one. I know, I'm sorry, Soph, but I really didn't want anyone at school knowing I was a superhero. Yeah, but like, we're besties. 
I know, but... No, no, it's okay. I get it. I mean, it does seem like a pretty dangerous life. And honestly, I thought my life was dangerous. I have to live in the same house as my smelly brother! <laughs> Ralph! But I'm sorry. I mean, you're my best friend. I shouldn't keep secrets from you, but my parents made me swear that we would never expose our real identities. Eh, no worries, my dude. But this is, like, so cool! I mean, can you teach me how to power blast? Zap people? Fly? Come on, come on, come on! <laughs> I wish I could so, but it's really not that easy. Eh, it was worth a shot. But hey, Britt, it's getting late. Um, I'm going to get grounded if I'm out any later. So, uh, see you at school tomorrow. Bye! And as I was saying, the scientific method is an empirical method for acquiring knowledge that has characterized the development of science since the 17th century. Oh, wait a second. Are you passing notes in my classroom? Uh, no, it was me. Oh my gosh, yeah, no, like, I, it, no. Liars, hand it over. <laughs> well, 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 what do we have here? It says Brittany is a superhero. Pass it on. <gasps> oh, no. What? What is this true? What is this nonsense? Um, uh, uh, no, it's definitely not true. Who would say such a thing? Oh my gosh, no. Quit lying, Britt. It's totally true. I saw her parents dressed as superheroes, and even Sophie tweeted about it. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> and the whole school is going to know about it. <laughs> oh, no. This is exactly what I didn't want to happen. Everyone's going to treat me different. The whole school is going to know I'm a superhero. No. Um, hey, bestie. Are you doing all right? No, Soph, I'm not. The whole school is going to learn a secret that I was trying to keep for a very long time. Dude, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean for this to happen. You know me. I tweet things if I sleep. It's okay, Soph. I know you didn't mean to do it. It was an accident. But what am I supposed to do now? Uh, I don't know. Fire me as your best friend? What? Absolutely not. Never. No, it's you. <laughs> what are you doing? Stop. I'm taking down the school. And there's no way you can stop me. You're just a little girl. Only a real superhero can stop me. Oh, well, you know nothing. Oh, yeah? You won't get away with this. I think I already have. Oh, my gosh, Britt. You need to save the school. I don't know. But Sophie. Britt? Come on. Who cares? We need a hero right now. You know what? You're right. I'll do the right thing. Go get him, Britt. You get back here now. Wait a second. It's you? Oh, yeah. And I'm here to stop you once and for all. It's time for a duel. <laughs> you don't stand a chance. All right, Mr. Evil. All my training has come to this moment. Well, let's put it to the test. Aw, but I see your little mommy and daddy are here to help you. <laughs> oh, hey. Not so fast. Take that. Oh. Brittany, dear, you've got this. Just stay focused. I will, Mom and Dad. Ha. Oh, my leg. There's more where that came from, buddy. Ah, so proud of you, dear. Yeah, finish him up. You can't hide from me. Get over here. Oh, miss. <laughs> stupid girl. I'm no stupid girl. Take that and that. Oh, you're a lot stronger than I thought. And I've been practicing. Oh. And one more punch for good luck. Oh, I'm frozen. This doesn't happen to me. Oh. Say goodbye, Mr. Evil. <laughs> I did it. I finished him once and for all. I can't believe it. You saved the school. And defeated Mr. Evil. Great job, kid. Ricky! Oh, my goodness. Wow. I don't believe it. You really are a superhero. Oh, yeah. See, I, I told you I wasn't kidding. Well, now it all makes sense. You saved the school. And Thank you, thank you. I'll erase all your lateness from your permanent record. You are a hero. Hey, Sarah. Yeah, what's up? I heard there's a princess in school. <gasps> oh my gosh, no way. I gotta go tell Darren. Oh my gosh, Darren, have you heard that there's a princess in school? Whoa, what? I can't believe it. I gotta go tell Alex. Yeah, dude, there's a princess in school. Well, I can't believe it. Who is it? Yeah, nobody knows. Who's crazy? Sophie!
Wait, dude, there's a princess in school. We gotta find out who it is. What? A princess? <laughs> I can't wait until I tell Brit about this. She's gonna lose her pineapples. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, no! What time is it? I just slept through my alarm. Oh, this is not good. I'm gonna be so totally late for school. I can't be late again. No, 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 no. Oh, I gotta change. Where's my clothes? Where's my backpack? Ah! Okay, oh, I gotta get out of here. I'm gonna be so totally late. Brittany, dear. <laughs> Bye, Mom. Where are you off to in such a hurry? Oh my gosh, Mom, I'm gonna be late for school. I slept through my alarm again. Wait, you almost left your crown on. Oh my gosh, thanks, Mom. You need to be careful, Brit. Nobody at school can know that you're a princess. I know, I know, I know. I just forgot. But I gotta get going, Mom. I'm really gonna be late. Okay, now remember, if anyone asks, Yes, Mom, I'm definitely not a princess. I got it. I gotta go. Love you. Bye. Catch you later. Oh, see you, dear. But remember, it's for your own good. Yeah, yeah, I know. Bye, Mom. I gotta get out of here. <laughs> At last, I finally found you, princess. <laughs> oh, I can't believe it. I finally made it in time. Oh, I'm so tired from running. It was a close call, though. Hey, girl, what's up? What took you so long? Hey, Soph, I'm so sorry I'm late. I slept through my alarm. <laughs> what a rookie move. That's why I have 14 alarms that go off every morning. You can't sleep through 14 of them. Honestly, Soph, I'd have to try that. Oh, bestie, I have been dying to tell you something. Ah! Oh, no. I'm sorry, Bestie, but we gotta get to class. We cannot miss this one. You're right. Come on, let's go. Okay, class, take your seat. Time to settle down. Everyone take out your notebooks. It's time to learn about invasive species and their impact on the environment. <laughs> like my little sister, she's an invasive species. That's enough, Harold. Now, chapter one. All right, students, that's all the time we have for today. We'll pick up chapter 10 tomorrow. See you later, Miss Smith. Dude, Miss Smith is literally the best teacher on the planet. I know, I love her class. But hey, you wanted to tell me something? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, that's right! Girl, get a load of this. There is a princess in our school. Oh my gosh, how did you find out? Dude, relax. It's just the word going around school. Wait, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, no, 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 no. The whole school knows, Sophie. <laughs> Don't be upset, bestie. Sure, you're the last to know, but happens. Oh gosh, um, okay, there's a princess in school and everyone knows about it. All right, all right, all right, oh no. no. Uh, Brent, what in the world is your problem? Uh, nothing. Oh, look at that, uh, time to go to the next class. I'll see you later, Soph, bye. Oh man, I'm so glad to be done with school today. I'm sorry, Bestie, but are you sure there's nothing wrong? Yes, yeah, Soph, why would you say that? I don't know, because ever since I told you there was a princess in school, you've been acting Oh, weird. Oh, I have? Um, uh, I'm sorry. I just kind of have a lot on my mind right now. Okay, but if you were the princess, you'd tell me, right? Um, uh... Right? Get in, loser! Oh, man! Forgot Ralph was picking me up today. I'll catch you later, bestie. All right, all right, hold your horse! Yes! Get in, come on! I can't believe it. Not only am I lying to my best friend, but the whole school is on to my secret. This is not good. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Oh, guards here. I gotta get in the car. Hey there! Hello, Miss Britt. How was your day? It was good. Oh, come on. I think we should get out of here. All right. Uh-oh. What's going on, guard? Um, uh, not to alarm you, princess, but I'm pretty sure someone is following us. Oh my gosh, what? No. All right, hold tight. I'm gonna try to lose them. Okay. All right, princess, right this way. Oh my gosh, I can't believe we were being chased. Now stay here. I have to go secure the perimeter. That was a close call. Brittany, dear. Daughter, is that you? Oh, hey, mom and dad. Oh, thank goodness you're home. We've been worried sick about you. Don't worry, I'm okay. That's good. Who do you guys think could be after me? 
Well, we don't know for certain. And I've ordered the guards to keep 24-hour surveillance on you. But dear, don't you think her classmates will notice a guard following her? Um, about that. Wait, you didn't tell everyone your secret, did you? No, honestly, I didn't. But somehow the entire school found out that there's a princess. <gasps> oh, 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 this Marcin, I thought. Terrible news, terrible news. Here, relax. Everything's going to be okay. I'm going to go talk with the head guard and figure this out. Oh, no. Brittany, you could be in great danger. This is not good. So, Britt, who is that person that dropped you off this morning in the funny hat? Oh, um, uh, 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 that was my cousin Clark. Um, he's visiting from, uh, England. Ha <laughs> He's got one awesome hat collection. Oh, yeah. So cool. <laughs> All right, everybody, take your seats. Hello, I'm Mr. Lowell, and I'll be a substitute teacher today. <gasps> what the heck? Where's Miss Smith? Oh, she's not feeling well today. Help, please. Someone get me out of here. I've been locked up. Help, help. <laughs> All right, class. Now, before we begin, I need to take attendance. Starting with Abby, Here. Andy, Here. Jessica, Evan. Alicia, Hi. Princess Brick. <gasps> um, what? I'm not the princess. <laughs> oh, yeah? Then who is? It is I, Princess Sophie Simpson. Wait, what the? Oh, yeah. You heard it. And you are all my royal subjects. Oh, my gosh, that's crazy. Wow. Well, I knew it was Sophie all along. That's right, people. I'm the princess, and you will all down to me. <laughs> that substitute teacher is one weird dude, am I right? Yeah, so tell me about it. <laughs> Eddie thought you were a princess. <laughs> what a card! Honestly, though, I'm just hoping Miss Smith is back tomorrow. She really left us on a cliffhanger with that invasive species lesson. Oh my goodness, so, so cool that you're a princess. <laughs> I know, right? Oh, Oh my goodness, are you, like, gonna throw a ball anytime soon? You know, there's something in the works. I'll let you know. Oh my gosh, <laughs> so cool. Catch you later, your highness. <laughs> this is awesome. Yo, Samson, you're royalty, huh? Oh, you bet I am, Charles. Now I order you to carry my books to my next period class. Oh, yeah, right away. Anything for you. I'll go get them in your locker. <laughs> You know, I could really get used to this royalty thing. You know, Soph, being a princess is not all it's cracked up to be. Oh, yeah? And how would you know? It's not like you're a princess. Well, I... What? I, um, uh, I gotta go to the bathroom. <laughs> I'll catch you later, Soph. All right, but if we don't hang out after school, my royal guards will throw you in the dungeon. Now, wait a sec. Where did my royal book carrier go again? Oh, I gotta go find him. Catch you later, Brad. Oh, man, if Sophie only knew what it was actually like to be a princess. It's not all that fun. Uh, I don't know what to do. I can't believe this. I've been wrong all along. No, this can't be true. Please, just let me go. Quiet, teach. Can't you see I'm busy here? Come on, please. I want to go back and teach my students. No, not until I kidnap the princess. This is crazy. I thought I had the right princess all along. I had everything set up to kidnap Brit. But now I have to get that Sophie girl instead princess. She thought she had me fooled, but I'll get her. And once I do, I'll take the royal family for all they've got. And I'll be the richest man in all of Roblox. <laughs> oh my goodness! Brad, I'm getting dizzy! Oh my gosh! Self, you're making me dizzy! <laughs> but you've had plenty of time in the mini car. Can I try, please? Brett, do you you can handle it? She's got a lot of Oh my gosh, of course, Sophie. I used to have a mini car just like this. Well, you be good to her and give her a test run. Oh my gosh, yes. All right, Sophie, here we go. <laughs> Whoa, oh, oh, you didn't see that. Brit, it's okay, Sophie. It's like really is fast. <laughs> Brit, be careful. Wait a second, hold on. Is that? No, it can't be. Octavius? Doing out here? General Ralph put you out 
here. Little buddy, you don't deserve to be. <laughs> I've captured the princess now. <laughs> So you're the princess, huh? Dude, I have no idea what you're talking about. Come on, come clean. Tell the truth. I know it's you. Dude, I ain't saying nothing. You can't get it out of me. You know what? Fine. Have it your way. The royal crown will pay me a billion dollars, and then I'll release you once I get all my money. Well, dude, you'll be waiting a long time because I'm not royalty. You know be. That's enough from you. I'm gonna go give word to the royal guards now. Let them know I have you, and I'll be expecting my money. <laughs> Whatever, dude. Wait, he's leaving. This is my chance. I gotta go save my bestie. Sophie, don't worry. I'm coming for you. Perfect, perfect. There's a door. Sophie! <laughs> oh my goodness! Let me out of here! Of course. Here you go. Oh my gosh. Girl, you won't believe it. That guy. Mama, I really was a princess for some reason. Well, so there's something I have to tell you. I'm actually the princess that he's after. Say what, Guitarnation? <gasps> Brynn, you lied to me. What the heck? Wait, no, Sophie, I, I can explain. Wait, Soph, Soph, Sophie, wait. Soph, wait up. Come on, bestie. Wait, I can't believe you. Look, I'm sorry I didn't tell you, but I just couldn't, okay? Because now you know firsthand how dangerous it is to be a princess. I guess it's true. And I thought about it on my run over here, and I'm not mad at you anymore. Well, I am mad, but not at you. I'm mad at that stupid freak of an idiot who captured me. No one captures Sophie Simpson. I'm so glad you can forgive me, Soph. But you're right. No one catches you and gets away with it. But now, Bestie, I'm so worried. What if you get kidnapped again and I can't save you? Well, I mean, it might not be a bad thing, actually. No, Sophie being kidnapped is terrible. Why would you ever want that? Well, I've been wanting a reason to skip school. I mean, um, I didn't say that. Anyway, let's go talk to your mom. Isn't she the queen? I think she can help us figure out a plan. You know what, Sophie? I think you're right. Come on, let's go. Dude, this is your house. This is insane. Uh, what? Princess Brid, there you are. Oh my goodness, we've been looking all over the place trying to find you. Thank you, sir, but I'm safe. That evil man that was after me kidnapped Sophie by mistake. Yeah, I mean, that was a princess, so I guess that's what I get for lying. Well, we're glad you're back. We've been searching the entire kingdom. Sorry to cause any alarm. Now, we have to go speak with my mom. Oh yes, right away, right away. Come on, Soph. Hello? Is anybody home? Oh my gosh, it's fancy. Brittany, dear, mom. Hi, Brent's mom. I think your highness. Queen lady, hi. Hi. <laughs> I'm Sophie, your best friend. Oh, well, Sophie, it's so nice to finally meet you. Oh, where have you been, Brittany? Mom, I was saving Sophie because the man that was after me kidnapped her. <gasps> oh, my goodness. I don't believe him. Have you guys finally figured out who this evil man is? We did. It's your stupid uncle that we kicked out of the family because he was a jerk. You've never met him before. Wait a second. This is family drama? This is crazy. All I know is when he had me locked 
locked up, he kept screaming about getting millions and billions from the royal family. So, Mom, he is after me to get money? That's all he wants? I'm afraid so, dear, because he used to be rich, and now he's poor because he spent all the money we gave him. Wait a second. People! People! On the phone! I have an idea. I've thought of just the plan of how to catch this guy. Wait, really? Sophie, that's amazing. What is it? You got to find a way to convince this guy that you're in on his evil scheme. <laughs> oh, it will be perfect. All right, I think this is the evil guy's house. I'm gonna go talk to him. Hey, hello? Is anybody in there? Hello? I hope he answers the door. Hey, you, what do you want? I've come here to tell you that I'm secretly the princess. You have the wrong girl. Wait, what the? So I, I was right in the beginning? You gotta be kidding me, you royals. Whoa, 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 hold your horses. Don't blame the royals. I know nothing like them. I hate them, actually. Wait a second. You hate them? <laughs> this is great. This will be perfect. I'm gonna hold you for ransom and call the queen. She's not gonna answer because she hates me, too. Wait, hold up. The queen hates you? <laughs> no kidding. She hates me as well. I'm her brother. Oh. Well, you know what? I think we should play a mean joke on her and then try to steal a bunch of money from the castle. What do you think? Oh my goodness. <laughs> That's the best idea ever. I knew I liked you. What do you say we head to the castle and get scamming? Ah, perfect. Let's go. All right, here we are. <laughs> wow, it's been years since I've been here. Come on, you're wasting time. Wait a second. It's awfully quiet in here. No one's home. Come on, this way to the safe. Huh? Wait a second. What the? Did you miss me? Brother. Uh, sis, hey, it's been years. How's it going? It's been better without you. Hey, look, uh, I'm here to say that uh, I want to be back in the royal family. Do you have a, a couple billion you could hand over to me? Huh, absolutely not. After you kidnap my daughter's best friend to the dungeon with you. What? No! That's what you get. You can't lock me away forever! No! <laughs> <laughs>